hi guys and welcome back to my channel once again and i hope you're all keeping well and safe as i said again due to this pandemic that's literally taken over the world um and please also ensure that you are subscribed and that you press that bell so as you can see i have in my bantu knots and this is a bantu knot take out and if i turn around you can see how they look now guys most people normally do this style because it is a protective hairstyle and a protective hairstyle basically means it gives your hair rest and it protects your hair from all the harsh you know pollution and chemicals um that's in our environment and the reason why it's a protective hairstyle is because the ends are wrapped in and properly concealed and it is also easy to apply oils to your hair when your hair is in a protective hairstyle it is so easy to apply your hair oil so for example when my hair well my hair currently is in bantu knots i was basically using the black castor oil black castor oil and what black castor oil does is i have a bit of notes here um it helps to enrich um our scalp um and it helps to increase the blood circulation and improves hair growth. This is why this oil is absolutely essential when it comes to hair growth and just keeping your hair silky, healthy looking and shiny and not brittle. And if you're a person that seems to have problems with like your hair, if it's constantly itching, because this hairstyle can actually be, be quite itchy. But if you have that problem with braids or whatever hairstyle that you do you always seem to be itching your scalp or your scalp gets irritated it's good to have an anti-itch oil and you can tell that i haven't used this this is an anti-itch oil by do grow and what you can do you could just simply just apply the oil apply the oil apply the oil because the tip of this makes it much more easier to um apply the oil to your hair so for example with this one i think i've already opened this one what is going on so for example can you see that simple quick and easy and guys and the reason why i'm adding this oil you might be thinking why is she adding oil if she's taking out her hair at the end of the day um you can't go wrong with moisturizing your hair and that is the benefit of actually doing bantu knots and other protective hairstyles so what i'm going to use to take these out is a wide tooth comb that also has this at the bottom okay and it might take a while and what you can do is this if you've done this style to achieve um curls i would advise you to apply oil to your hair so it can be oil um such as even literally stimulating hair oil any hair oil it can also be olive oil any type of oil you can apply to your hair so yeah you guys pretty much get the point so yeah if you're doing this to achieve a certain style please ensure that you add oils to your hair before and obviously we put i've had rubber bands put in at the start of each band too not just to keep it a bit more tight and concealed it's quite easy to take out the rubber bands at the start is a bit, you know. Can you see that, guys? Can you see that? So, if you're also thinking about doing this style, go for it. 
go for it. It's a protective hairstyle. Um, it looks okay, I guess. It looks okay. But I didn't really wear this hairstyle out. I literally just wore it for like a jog. And just be careful with your hair ends with these rubber bands. Just pull your hair apart very carefully and delicately. Do not rip your hair ends. Can you see how I'm trying to just do it really slowly? So as you can see, half is like out. And obviously what you need to do is just pull the curls out to get more of a defined look if that's what you are looking for. So half out and half in. One million off, no more pocket. Put it, put it, so fit that the jaws off. I should jump it, different cup rings, so the cup rings never off, not a socket. So, guys, I've taken everything out. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm taking it out. And guys, my head is so sore. So, so, like, sore. And what you can do is if you've left your Bantu knots in for longer, the curls will come out better and they will stand out more. But obviously, if you're just doing it for a protective hairstyle, you can just get your wife to comb and just carefully go through each curl bit by bit. And just turn with the hair and I'm just gonna let my hair just stay like this whilst I'm in the house just give my hair some air and then I'm just gonna apply some oils that I showed you earlier on in the video and my hair feels quite moisturized And guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, 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 and do not leave from here without pressing the bell.